happy people i'm back with another video and today i have another bath and body works review for you all so i actually have a scent i think it's been discontinued unfortunately but it's in my collection and i am using it and i wanted to share my thoughts on this scent with you all and who knows you all might be able to still find this scent either on macari on ebay or even on amazon so i figured i'd still make the video just in case there were anybody out here that was curious about this scent but it is the line coco shea honey you guys this scent is amazing <laughs> okay so i am going to start with the order in which i would use the items so i would start with this um so i'm going to start with the coco shea honey softening body scrub so it says it has cocoa butter shea butter and pure honey in it this is what the packaging looks like i absolutely love the packaging from this line like it looks so sleek i love that that gold against that black background looks so beautiful and then here it's kind of peeping peeping through kind of like um like the bee stripes where you can see the actual sugars i mean where you can see the actual scrub in there so really like that a lot um scent notes on this is it just says that it's a softening body scrub with pure honey almond oil has smoothing sugar crystals and leaves skin feeling soft and soothe. This is absolutely correct. This stuff right here leaves your skin super feeling super moisturized when you get out the shower. So, um, well, how would I describe this scent? Oh, oh, it smells so good. <laughs> it just smells like shea butter and honey. And the shea butter is like so creamy and rich. Like normally when you think shea butter, you don't think creamy, but it's like a creamy rich shea butter with honey drizzled on top of it. Like this stuff smells really delectable. It smells really good. So um, I do enjoy this um, body scrub. However, it is slightly oily. So there are some scrubs where you use them and it, it doesn't leave that oil film kind of in that in your tub um, or on your body. Um, this one is one that does do that. But I find with those type of scrubs, they typically leave more moisture on your skin when you're getting out the shower, which is actually a good thing. So with this, normally when I shower, I'll, you know, lather a few times and then I'll like exfoliate and then I'll rinse off and then lather one more time. But this, I can't exfoliate in between lathers. I literally have to do the scrub at the very end because I will, I like to leave that kind of film of oil on my skin because it locks the, it, cause it keeps my skin feeling moisturized when I get out the shower. So, um, I really do like this scrub a lot. It smells so good. It's really thick and it's really, it's really thick. How would I describe the consistency of it? So it's really thick and it really kind of has the consistency of honey. It's kind of like sugar mixed in honey. So yeah, I really like this a lot. If they bring this back, I would definitely pick it up again. It's really nice. But again, when you use this in the shower, make this your very last step right before you get out the shower because it's going to leave your skin feeling more moisturized that way. So I have the sugar scrub here. Really like it. Would recommend it. After I'm done using this, I get out the shower and then I go in with the Coco Shea um, lotion the body lotion um love this as well so um i've actually went through a whole body butter in this that's actually how i was introduced to this line so i took a trip to visit my brother once and um he actually was using this scent and his wife actually had recommended it to him and then he recommended it to me and i fell in love with it and i was like whoa like where'd you get this from and i think at the time they didn't even have it in the store and so he let me take the body cream home with me the body butter home with me and i'm gonna tell you right now like i fell in love with the scent i used it up I used it actually sparingly because I thoroughly enjoyed the scent and I enjoyed how moisturized it had my body feeling and so of course when I saw it at the store back in the day I had to get it so um, this is the lotion it's just as hydrating just as moisturizing as the body butter um, a slightly less hydrating because it is a lotion it's not as thick of a consistency but for a Bath and Body Works lotion this is a pretty thick consistency and the hydration is really good when this stuff says 24 hour moisture it really is 24 hours when I put this stuff on my skin Skin. I feel hydrated all day long and the scent on this is so nice it's so soft it's so powdery it smells like shea butter honey and powder that's what it really smells like and it you'll be smelling that way from morning to night um so yeah really enjoy this lotion like I said I'm sad they don't carry it anymore but I would highly recommend this really good 
And then after I do the lotion, I do top it off with the Coco Shea Honey Body Oil. You all, I really enjoy the body oils from Bath & Body Works. Like they are really good. They're not too greasy. They're not too oily. When you put it on, it absorbs right into the skin, but it still keeps you feeling nice and hydrated. And the scent on the body oils, they last. Like it actually um, performs. It actually gives a fragrance off of your skin. Like I really enjoy that a lot. So I do put the oil on top of this and I have just been absolutely loving this set. The body oil smells just as good as the scrub and just as good as the body lotion. Yeah, it's just really good. So the one thing I also enjoy about the oil is that um, you can use it in a variety. You can use it with a lot of different scents. So I've been pairing this with my champagne, apple and honey. Loved it. I paired it with my hot cocoa and cream. Loved it. I paired it with um, one other scent. Oh, I also paired it with Christmas cookies. Loved it. So this is pretty universal as far as mixing it with different um, scents from Bath and Body Works and still having it not disrupt the scent. Um, that you're using it kind of more so complements it and enhances it so yeah um that is the coco shea honey line from um, bath and body works um let me know your thoughts on this did you all get a chance to check out the coco shea line when they had it um i know they had different versions of it i did try out the coco shea coconut body oil i actually have a backup of that as well as a backup of this and i'm super happy about it because i love those oils um but they also have like i think they had the coco shea cucumber and maybe like one or two other scents from the coco shea line do you all remember that line like <laughs> it's really good so yeah let me know your thoughts on that and if you all have used it or not i hope you all enjoyed this video um i do upload every tuesday thursday and saturday saturdays in particular are my bath and body works videos so if you all like what you saw here stick around and join the happy family i'd love to have you and as always you guys leave some love in the comments down below and i'll see you in my next video i hope you all have a wonderful awesome spectacular day bye